Hey guys, welcome to today's Everything Digital, the show where we bring you everything cool, everything hip, and yes, that's right, everything that's digital in your world today. And as always, I'm your hostess with the mostest, Faith History Insa, and I will be your digital guide on this series. Now, today we're going to be talking about art, all about art, digital art, regular art that is being put online and how people are making money and getting attention for their artistry. All right. So uh, with me, I've got Bolanle, uh, who you know, you may know or you may remember her as the winner of Coco Mansion. Remember Coco Mansion? Cocolettes in the mansion? Yes, she won that. So she's still very much a cocolette. And here <laughs> she is. Voila Hi, Lake. Lega City. What's going on? What's up, everybody? Uh, bonjour. Konnichiwa. <laughs> Hola, como estas? <laughs> Why are you speaking all these other languages in Lagos? <laughs> oh, my God, because there are people listening from all over the world. I, I like that. I don't oh, yeah. you, I give mean, me. But, but you. My fans are from all over the world. Okay. Well, our <laughs> fans are from all over the world. Konnichiwa. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Oh, right. Konnichiwa. What's happening? How it, are you? It's, it's good. It's good. We're here. We're good. I'm excited to have you on. You're an artist. And so one of the things that I started thinking about when I realized that you were going to come, when you accepted to come on the show, uh, was, you know, I said, you know, let me look at what artists are doing online, right? Like other artists and stuff like that. And when we're talking mm-hmm. about art, you know, uh, there's different forms of art, you know, but you also, uh, beyond singing, you also actually make art. You're a painter. And and so last year, uh, there were a couple of African artists that caught that got discovered. So when I went on the web, I found that that they got discovered by just putting their work online, especially on Twitter, which is so weird because you're beginning it to be on Instagram, but <laughs> Twitter. <laughs> The retreats and all that, there you know, is everything these days. it's everything, okay. right? So, uh, so we look at the case of like Eli Waduba, who's a pencil art artist, rather, and he did a pencil art of Kevin, Kevin Hart, Hart right? I and people that. retweeted until Kevin Hart I actually saw that. saw that, you know, and got him some more customers on top, you know. So, That's I'm like, right. yo, this, <laughs> this is awesome. And then, uh, there was also a Senegalese artist, uh, I don't know his name, he paints upside down, I don't know why mm. he does that. Might just be a gimmick. <laughs> he might just really Sleep be Spider Man. <laughs> so African Spider Man. Oh my god! In fact, that's what I will give him when I see him. Script. I'm like flip scripters. Yeah, Script like flipper. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. African Spider Man, upside oh down. Goodness. And then his followers keep growing every day. So mm-hmm. this just goes to show you, like that you know the old way where you know you just see artists in a gallery or artists on the streets. It's no longer the only way that you can share your art and when you're making art, like you can share it online. So let's talk about um, the ways that, you know, people kind of, you know, share their art. How do you share your art? Like, what does art mean to you? Art is everything. Like music, art is life. Mm. Art speaks to the soul, you know, and no matter what you're going through, when you see beautiful art, you can relate to it. You can appreciate it. So <laughs> art is beautiful. Art is everything good. And there, like you said, there are different ways to share art these days. Online is is the marketplace. Mm. Everybody's online these days. You know, so art, I put my art on Twitter. I put my art on Instagram. I put my art everywhere. Mm-hmm. And people and you have a, in. you actually have a, a different handle for your art, right? Art by Bolanle. So right. that's where you put just the artwork that you create. Every art, every kind of art I create is mm-hmm. on there. Do you also share other people's artwork? Sometimes. Sometimes. Like what really inspires you or something that you like? Something beautiful. Something beautiful. Once I see something I can relate to, something I think is magical, mm. I just put it out there. Something is magical. <laughs> yes, I am. Magical. I haven't oh, used that boy. word in a long time. You can see I'm getting hard. <laughs> My jaw hard. Magical. Okay. What is that? Magic. <laughs> I've got magic. Oh, boy. <laughs> Dude. Okay. No shade. But like I remember... Uh, back in the day, like I had a show on African magic and I'd shared with my American friends and I'd be like, hey, I have a show on African magic. And they're like, you've got a magic show in, Ar- in oh Africa? God. I was like, no, the name of the channel, the name of it's the channel touch. You is need to let African them know. magic. It's touch. That's what nah. we're pushing on African magic. You know what I'm saying? Midas touch. <laughs> I should have been your friend back then. You would have helped me. Well, it's good timing now. <laughs> yeah, it good is. timing. <laughs> High five to that. I like that. All right. So in your mind, like, what's the art climate like in Nigeria? Is it thriving? Is it like, you know, where it needs mm. to be? Is it conducive to young artists like yourself? It's getting there. It's it's um, it's um, It's growing. 
Mm. And growth is very key for any sector. So um, it's, it's beautiful. I like the fact that there's a lot of things happening, things that did not happen, things that were not there like a decade ago. Mm-hmm. So, <clears throat> Have so you ever been to Art, uh, Art, uh, Art, Art X? X? Yeah, I've heard a lot about it uh, because I've not really been in the country for a while now. Because mm-hmm. I, I can hear any accent. I can, <laughs> She's like, you know, she's still. Hey, sh- you kill I, me. I need to travel. I need to travel because you know you you're saying things like I can hear the American like going up and oh then uh, at the end of your words go up like that. You know, like your inflection. It's just like up there. You know, we in Nigeria we're down here, oh down, come down, go it, get there, come here. Are you okay? Are you mad? Okay, Lagos sorry. Lagos traffic is Lagos doing traffic. Lots of people. Oh my god. So <clears throat> Lagos traffic gets you. Lagos traffic is like that. Um, the other world. Lagos uh, traffic. It's, it's, I I make this joke that Lagos traffic one day is going to vex, like a transformer, <laughs> not transformer. Oh but my god! The transformers. Now that you talk about that, do you know that Lagos? Someone should actually work on a movie and make Lagos traffic the villain. That's what and I'm talking about. The, the and so, until so all the cars will get together and become this grand transformer <laughs> that's called Lagos Traffic. And then Lagos Traffic will be like, I oh am dear. now here. Oh we're too now to talk. Oh, yeah. Everybody's going to run. And some people, I mean, I think we're tough in Lagos. It could be a really cool animation. <laughs> Who wants to work on it with us? I think we're tough. Artist, yeah, producer, that, like, what are we doing? Speaking about art, that part of art is being experimented now mm. there are a lot of um 3d artists and 4d artists in nigeria mm-hmm. there are a lot of artists that are working with animation and all sorts of good stuff and you're like this is coming from nigeria right so it's some- it's it's evolving we're it starting is. to evolve are, and get really digital are. with our art i want to talk there. more about that let's take a quick break when we come back you're going to tell me some of your favorite artists absolutely okay and then we're going to talk about some truths i want you to open up to me uh-huh. open your heart uh-huh. So, all right, guys, I'm here with the beautiful Bolanle Okira, who is a singer. She's an artist. She's a writer. She's a presenter. She's an actress. She does it all. In fact, when you are thinking artists, you think of her. Thank you. Thank we'll be you, right thank back. You, thank you. Kind. All right. <laughs> we'll be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. And we're back. Thanks for joining us. I'm still here with the artist, multi-talented Bolan Leo Kira, whose handles on social media are? At Stereo Goddess, at Art by Bolan Le. Okay, so you got two different handles. Nice. And uh, I want to find out uh, from you, um, you know, what who 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 is what what's your favorite art form? I guess I want to ask that first because then I'm gonna ask my next question. I was gonna you know so what's your what's your favorite art form? Because you yourself uh, are a self-described like multi-talented artist. So you are presenting, you can sing, you can actually <laughs> paint and draw and all that. Can I so sing? You, can, you know, so you can do different things. You can't sing. I can I sing? You're not sure. Maybe sometimes. In oh the Lord! Okay, let's take the out corridor. the singing uh, in the cor- If it's corridor singing, oh forget it. But I can write a lot of music. Okay, you know, so you freestyle. so you write more so. than you than you'd be on 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 the mic singing. Okay, freestyle, Maybe. freestyle, 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 freestyle is hard work. A lot of word, um, spoken word. Spoken word. Okay, different. okay. So that's so those are the things that you can do. But what are your favorite types of art forms? Hmm. Or which so, one is your favorite? I would say. Okay, uh, so as for the creative arts, I mm. love graffiti a lot. Oh, graffiti! graffiti. Is beautiful, yeah. I think I think there's something about graffiti that is both um, collected and it's like it's like focus and unfocus, and I like it because it's it's like it meets you at it meets you somewhere. You know, you try to get into it, an artist's mind, and you're mm-hmm. like, "Where is it going with this? What what is it going with this? Where mm-hmm. was he before?" Where is he right now? You know, so there's I like the confusion and focus of graffiti of art. Graffiti art, right? That's right. Mm, okay, you're a troublemaker. I can see. <laughs> oh my Even god! Even your hair, you can see that she's a troublemaker. <laughs> oh my Am I lying? No, you guys. No, seriously. I know some of you are just listening, so you can't see us. But if you can see right now, she got that hair. She got the big afro, and she combed it forward like this. Just in your face, like I ain't playing. I ain't playing out here with y'all. Do but I like your style. Thank I like you, your style. You. Okay, like so gra- so graffiti, right? Is is your is your art form of choice that you like? You enjoy? Yeah, Any of your favorite artists that you can share with us? 
Is that a graffiti artist? That's for artist? Nigeria. It has to be Osa Seven. I was going to say really, that. Really like, like, he's known. His art. And um, internationally, uh, there's someone from South Africa. He does he does a lot of elephants on the wall. Mm. And, and the way he does it, there's a way, there's a pattern to... He creates all sorts of stories on walls with elephants and it's graffiti and it's beautiful. I, I forget his name now. No, don't worry. Google uh, will tell us. We'll, we'll just go <laughs> elephant on because Absolutely. me. Absolutely, you will I'm find him. I'm a proper he's, researcher. He's, <laughs> I'm like Google. I'll just say, hey he's Google, so okay popular. Google, show me the artist yeah. from South Africa who yeah. paints elephants on yeah. a wall, and, and he will. And and yeah, so I like people that do a lot of murals like that. Okay. And. Um, and and I like music. Mm-hmm. I like a lot of music. Mm. I Favorite like, artist right now? That would be music so artist. hard because there's a lot of good music out there. I like Billie Eilish. Who? I, Billie Eilish. She Billie just, Eilish. She okay. just won like five Grammys in one night. And nice. It's her first time out. She's doing great. And she's she's my kind of artist. Mm. I like um I like a lot of I like a whole lot of people. Any Jayla Nigerian? Fave. Uh yeah. I love every nigerian producing good music right now mm-hmm. uh yeah um name one name one I, <laughs> pick Yemi one day is someone that i really respect mm. i like the fact that she's really preserving african art mm. and the music the, the out, language the, the style it preserves the style the fashion and that's kind of what my art is about mm. my art is about preserving some part of african art nigeria some part of nigeria that we can all relate to which is our fabric the Ankara mm. so I like I like when I see things like that I like mm. I like when I see colorful stuff mm. and, she, and she dances too you know so she's like everything she embodies what an artist should be yeah that's and why like she that's why she too. goes with the mama Africa you know Absolutely. That, that's her she's vibe it. she's yeah. really owning it yeah and I love <laughs> that and she's just staying true to herself and, and what will make her you know what will continue to be her and her legacy i think Absolutely. that's awesome okay now let's go into a truth serum all right true time what do you want to hear i want to hear ask me anything what can make you <laughs> give up art wow there's one thing that can make you to give it up what, what could, is it what could that be what could make you give up presenting that's like that's like i could never stop talking i could never stop talking about beautiful things like i could never stop being a presenter i could never stop being an artist i could never don't ask stop me that being kind of creative. question no me i'm different go. from you oh my god look at what that. can make me it give up <laughs> presenting me 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 ah <laughs> <laughs> many things wow many 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 things like what many 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 oh, many me, many zeros one. a check oh okay. zeros for me, it's so beyond. It's so beyond. Me. I'll be on a beach somewhere, okay, and I'll just be like, "Yeah, I'm not a presenter anymore, but I'm over here." <laughs> oh my yeah. god! Yeah, I would like, never. Oh my literally. god! I don't know how many zeros can ever. I would never give up. Not, you will never give it up. Not for the really? zeros. Not for the gazillion Aww, zeros in the you're world. You're such a real I true would never artist. Do that. Thank God, me, I'm just a fake presenter. Oh boy, <laughs> that is crazy. I tell you what. <laughs> I tell you on a serious note, though. I don't know. I, I'll collect the money, Sha. I'll collect it okay. and then I'll give myself some time. Maybe like, <laughs> oh my gosh, maybe like, like a month. Think about it. No, I, no, no, I will agree. I say, oh, I'm giving it up. No problem. Don't worry. <laughs> Just give me the money first. Then one month later, you see me again. <laughs> oh say, auntie, God. why are you presenting? I'll oh be like, God. ah, your money has finished. If you want me to stop again, one more check. Like that, like that. It's all about the money, money, money. Just name your prop. Well, it's not all about the money. I'm just saying, like, I ain't gonna give it up. I'm just gonna you. You just gonna think that I've given it up. I'm gonna get your money and still present. <laughs> there you go. She has for a nighter I too. will do that to you. Yes, because I won't give it up. I agree with you. Because when I think about it, like, yeah, I'll take the money and then I'll be like, you know, on my private beach and I'll be bored. Because yeah, I can't I mean, do what I love. Because beaches are everywhere. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. beach, the beach is a lifestyle. So it's, yeah. it's and something it's, and, it's, and it's not just a lifestyle. Like, it's a part of a lifestyle. Your lifestyle is made up go. of little things that you do, right? Like, everything together as a exactly. whole is your lifestyle. So That's there's right. a time for the beach. Even the surfers, they go. go home, dude. <laughs> they do go home. They don't sleep in the <laughs> ocean. Even the mermaids sometimes come on land. You see them, Mama Water. They will say, yeah, "We are here." And you say, "Why? Are you know, inside the ocean." They will say, "We are." Okay, right can here. I tell you a truth? So, um, since we're talking about truths, and you yeah, just mentioned Mama Water, 
<laughs> oh, you're a real mommy water. <laughs> oh my God, look at that. She's going there. there. No, okay, you're <laughs> not. Oh you're God. not. No, she's got legs. She's you got are legs. crazy. <laughs> well, so whenever I... They've said so, but I don't agree. <laughs> whenever I have seafood, I like to have it with some shots of tequila or vodka or something but even if it's one shot guess why why in some part of my head i'm like in case under the hair in case the huh you said in some, in part, some of part of your of hair head. or your head in some part of my head okay correct. i'm thinking because i was gonna be like <laughs> it's just like where yeah like in front of the back, <laughs> yeah, right middle, and she's, but, she's hiding <laughs> some vodka in her <laughs> hair God, like you're crazy. That, that's what i was just thinking like <laughs> girl you should have shared it since oh, now okay i'm just kidding this is not i'll give you a shot later okay yeah in some part of my head i'm like in case some of that mommy water spirit you know got into the seafood at some point you want to clear it out feel the spirit with some spirit i mean you can't go wrong trust me you cannot go wrong think about it first bolanle come on be green there are always things that my guests will say that i'll just be like please he's he's over the show is over now you are killing marine spirit with spirit. Oh, shock me one time. Shock me. Shock me. I'll never again eat seafood without downing something. It's like, I'm like, yeah, you know, I, I oh learned my. this. This is a skill. Now, guys, this is a skill. I learned this from my friend Bolale. This is what we do. Okay, so I like that. All right. I encourage you, listen, don't join us. Be on your own. Day or day, we are daying our day over here. All right. <laughs> Let's move on. Okay. What's the worst reaction that you've gotten to like a piece of work that you've created? You put your whole heart and soul into it. And then you get this reaction and you're like, what? Your heart just breaks. I've never got none of that. I've never. I People always adore whatever mm. I put out some reason sometimes the reaction is actually more than i expect and i'm like mm. i just did that so what is the best reaction since you n- never had a worse what's the best one uh, i think the best is is i can't even explain it because it's on their faces if i could mm. put a word to it i'm like I'm, I'm shocked that you feel that way i'm happy though any crying you know that crying oh, wailing. Not that. i don't think <laughs> wailing though i mean I, i'll check are you pregnant? Can I take you to a, <laughs> to a hospital? Somewhere? Right, like it's something I, else wrong because it can't be my okay? art. It can't be me. Wailing, my art is good vibes and right. wailing would not be associated. No, some me. people can wail because they're happy. Wow, that's it's a happy that's wail. Intense. That's intense. Around here, I think we're still very conserved. Yeah, we we, to, we hold our to, emotions. Yeah, because even at concerts and um, shows, mm. you know, you don't really find people do that. <laughs> Willing. Even when I won Coco Mansion reality TV mm. show, and <clears throat> I remember stepping to the UK, and there were more fans in the UK that were people like, were crying. Oh my god, they were like, crying. Oh, they were hugging. I mean, it was like close to that. Oh my god, feeling. I can't believe like, you. you are, you're real. You're like a hold me, touch me. Show. Oh, you know what I'm saying? I think people. Oh. I think here Lagos traffic does so much to us. Please that stop <laughs> blaming it on Lagos traffic. We're hard yeah, people. people. We're hard. <laughs> that's that's the thing. So we we're are so, hard we people. So hard. We're not really in tune and with that's our emotions. Our, with our emotions, with our core emotions. Yeah, because. It gets, I mean, look, you're driving in traffic and someone bashes your side mirror. You're like, oh, you're getting, you're almost getting as hard as that person. They're almost getting you to the other side. Mm. And you can't really, if you want to hug someone, you're just like, hey, what's up? You know, you, you don't mm. even have, we don't really Even hug. when we see our, like, our, our artists that we really admire, like, yeah. you know, you, love. You and other day. people, you know, outside of Nigeria, be like, oh my God, I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> the face is done spoil. But Nigeria is like, eh, I don't know. Uh-huh. You know so, what I'm saying? So uh-huh. <laughs> so you're dead. So you're dead beside us at the table. Then we won't eye you, Seb. So we need to get to And you'll be like, come on now, show me some love. Yeah. Show yeah. me some love. We need to totally get that. So we need a little bit more. Um, we need to open our hearts. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> so when I say open your heart, your heart people. Open, you know, it's just like. We need no, to open up your heart. There. I'm like. Yeah. Open your heart. You know, your heart is there. So your hair. You yeah. see it. Yeah. You know uh, what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. I agree. I agree. I'm with you under <laughs> under the hair. I was about to say my my hair, my heart. No, no, it's oh two different God. places of the body. All right. So before we go, though, I want you to share a plug with us, right? But let's go to another quick break. When we come back, something it could be a life hack. It could be an app. It could be like something that you use that you just like. Okay, I'm gonna gift this to your listeners. I want them to have a piece of this magic. 
magical, like you say, that a uh, piece of something magical that everybody needs to know about. Okay, think about it. And when we come back, you can share it. Okay. All right. Okay, guys, we're going to take another quick break. My name is Faith History. You're listening to Everything Digital. And I'm here with Bolan Lee, the artist. And she's saying, <laughs> get into your heart a little bit more, Nigerians. Come on. Let's do it. Do it through art. All right, we'll be right back. And we're back, guys, from the break. Thank you so much for joining us one last time before the show ends. Well, Anli, you were supposed to give me some <laughs> plugs, right? Like a plug minimum. Okay. Telling me something. Is a live hack? Is it an app? What are you going to share with us? I'm going to share with you an... Um, I was going to say an app, but I think I'm going to say it's a life hack. Okay. And uh, I like to cook. So this one is for lovers of food like me out there. Foodies, hey, listen up. This is for you. Put your pens to paper and let's do this. So, <clears throat> to make your food taste better, I love the silence in the room. <laughs> All right, so to make your food taste better, um, what you can do is put some oil in a pan, chop some onions, chop some garlic, chop some um, ginger, and fry this together. Add some thyme. If you have rosemary, you can add it too. And that's a zing. Just when you hear the shri sound, toss it into whatever you're cooking and it will give it a taste that everybody's gonna ask you, what have you done differently to your cooking? It's just gonna add everything good. Okay, all right. <laughs> is this a digital life hack or is a real life hack? Oh because this is a real life hack. This is a real life hack. Okay, yeah, I love it. I'll, I'll take it. it. I want a digital <laughs> hack though. I want something that people can do okay. uh, from wherever they are and they don't have to be in a kitchen. Hmm, right. Where else? Could but you I'll need take to that I'll magic, take your yeah. food magic because <laughs> wait, tell me I the ingredients again the, because yeah, people are like, the amount are watching it <laughs> already. Just even listening to this thing. Okay, so it's we're adding onions, up the the oil, onions, onions, onions garlic, ginger, garlic, ginger, thyme, rosemary, thyme, rosemary. Boom. No curry. Just let it go. Well, curry is very good depending no. on what you're cooking. Not every food requires curry. Got it. If but it this these things that you've curry, added up are are. Or they can go with anything. They can. If you have to add curry, though, it's better fried like that. Ooh, yeah. Just mm. add it. And, it's and the then same. anything you're making. Everything just tastes. Noodles. Just taste. Add it. Jollof rice. Oh add it. Uh, fried rice. You know what add I'm it. saying? Uh, soup. This, add it. There's a zing. Uh, cornflakes. Add again. Uh, well, she, she rolls like that. You know what I'm saying? She fries her cornflakes. You are crazy. <laughs> That's what she does. <laughs> yeah. I just want to make sure you guys no, are awake. No, your children do not like I breakfast. I just even wonder why wanted they do not to like make they sure like that you guys are paying they attention. They don't want to eat breakfast. Because some people will be dead. They say, and then I was listening to everything. They did. Oh they said, we should add this mix to everything she that we're cooking. Something. No, people. Do <laughs> not add it to the cornflakes. Only add it to things that you're cooking on the stove. Can you add it to quick carrots too? I didn't know about that. I do not. So anything know about that is flavorful. <laughs> no, because some people don't know how to cook. Oh people should not look at me this funny. People do not know she how to does cook. Not, you, what are you? <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just you have to no. My people are very smart, but some of them don't know how to cook. Mm -hmm. So if it's a matter of this uh, mix that you're saying, you need to tell us what we're adding it to. <laughs> JJ. You know Beans, we can add it. Absolutely. Um pepper that soup. Part. Oh my goodness, the zing. Try it. So anything that needs a zing, I think that's the magic word. You yeah. need it to zing? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. You don't need to add pepper. You didn't mention pepper. pepper. So yeah, depending on some people don't, don't eat, pepper. eat pepper. Okay, but if, if you, you like just pepper. want a little bit of a taste, mm, yeah. zing, add it. Zing it up. Zing it up, baby. <laughs> you need a zing, think about it. Ball and lay zing, all right? all right? Don't add it to complex, so you're on your own. <laughs> okay, all right. So digital hack though, something, an app, that, um, <clears throat> you know, or, or an app that helps you to not be digital. That one, I well, that what I'd say, um, <clears throat> if you want to be orderly, mm -hmm. if you like order a lot, mm -hmm. and you're always on your laptop or phones, you probably know this, but not everybody remembers to do it. <clears throat> Some people are so scattered. Like you check their home screen, desktop, desktop, and it's like scattered. 
Oh, please, can you check my own? <laughs> She's like, now I'm going to be checking everybody. Yeah, check oh mine. God. Is this scattered? This is so funny. Okay, it's funny, but is this scattered? Wow, that's a lot. That's a whole lot of stuff that they're not in folders. They obviously, you obviously don't do folders so much. I do folders. They're just not on the desktop. These because desktop the, things are like things that I need all the time. That's the thing. So you're saying I should so put, I should put folders like on my desktop? You see what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, you can put a lot of things into folders. And when I look at your screen i see only maybe like 20 this is like 100 you need you guys need to see what's going on here there's like 100 open, <laughs> open these, these are the 100 things that and are in my do brain you remember so how do you know which one to go because it's like all over the place and it, it, you know why i do it this way it makes me read i'll be like okay, okay. i'm looking for <laughs> document x and you just find it there. oh there's this other document. Oh, forget document X. Let me go to document. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wow. I'm pretty yeah. scattered. But, you know, I'm trying to get a little bit more organized. So, so what is folders, this tool? Folders will help you. Just go into, I mean, make folders. If you have, like you said, if you're looking for document X, mm -hmm. you can, I'm sure there's not just one um, element here or item that is related to that so you can find other documents, documents that, that are similar or mm -hmm. similar and create and a folder the, for them yeah you can actually put the big x on them and you mm. know that you have all your x documents ah. in one folder and if you have y's <laughs> you need to find y's so on and so forth and you find everything easily okay all right i'll take is that the hack it is absolutely organizing, organizing. putting your stuff in folders documenting okay Putting your documents in folders. All right, guys. Don't forget to uh, listen to the show. Thank you so much, Walani, for coming on, Thank talking you. to us about art, talking to us about, you know, your um, handles, your businesses. What's next for you before you go? Hmm. I am looking to really, really make a mark in presenting and acting. Entertainment generally is my thing. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking to, I'm, I'm that person that, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> you need some water? Uh, I'll, I'll get Somebody, that something what? I always say is, mm -hmm. as long as I live, I want to be able to be productive. I have a purpose, and I want to actually tell people out there: people get tired. People, there's a lot of all sorts of things going on on the internet these days. You open up and you see yeah, children taking their own lives, and all sorts of crazy things going on in the world. And I tell people: you're gonna get tired. I mean, sometimes we have a field day and we get tired. If you have a purpose in life, you will pull through. So remind yourself what your purpose is. For me, it's waking up and being productive and telling myself I have a quota to contribute to life. Mm. So this is always my next move, contributing something to life. Contributing to life. And that's what we can look oh, forward to from you, Balanle Okira. Thank you so much for coming on the show. And like I always me. say, um, I did a post yesterday, I think on my on my Instagram. And um, so if you're listening today, then obviously you'll have to go look through my Instagram at Faith History. And uh, I, I basically say, when you're tired, learn to rest, not quit. There All right, go. learn to rest. So go. even though you're gonna get tired, there's a lot going on in Lagos, a lot going on in the world just rest just be like oh this is the day that i must just find extra rest but don't quit all right get the energy gain back up and like bonnie said you have a quota you have something to contribute think about what that is and that should be your purpose all right thank you so much for tuning into the show we love bringing it to you as always woo, woo, woo. and until next time bolale we'll be catching you same place same time for everything digital and is there something that you're wanted to say <clears throat> just before i go i dropped you what and just before i go i was gonna show you something oh wow you made this <laughs> i did make this that. is part of your art it is this is nice <laughs> a whole map of nigeria you know uh on this a clock. you know it's, it's a clock alarms it nice doubles. So you can hang it at your bedside. You can hang it in your kitchen. Why would I want to hang office. an alarm at my bedside? I don't like to People, wake up. You don't like. Oh, you don't like to wake up. How did you get here? On time. <laughs> like, yeah, I don't like, to, like to wake. <laughs> I don't like to wake up on time. I don't like to be woken up by an alarm. Yeah. But I love this anyway because so I can torture doubles. my kids and put it in their room. <laughs> you see that alarm, eh? <laughs>
<laughs> and the whole map of Nigeria is there. And so sometimes if you like, you're cooking. I know you spend time in the kitchen sometimes, right? Yes, yeah, sometimes. You want to time the oven. You want to time your food. Yeah, you can do that. It's very you useful. Time your workout. You're working out. I'm, I'm very big on working out. Yeah. Like workout. Time your workout. Yeah. So does this belong to me, or you just came straight to me? Let's just say it belongs to you. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> you know, because sometimes you know. You have to say, is it my own? Or maybe she just came to show us and she'll collect it back. I have to get that. Cameras, you know? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate it. I really love it. Thank you so much. So this is what you're talking about with the Ankara and something practical, usable, That's friendly right. nowadays. And, you know, it's like, I like it. I like it a lot. Thank you. Appreciate it. You're I welcome. accept that with love. <laughs> And that's the show for us today. Catch us again next week for more digital people, people that are using digital uh, technologies in various ways, using social media to push their brands and so much more. Don't forget, guys, you can communicate with us. We are everywhere. We're on social media. We are on WhatsApp. That's 0813-888-0585. You can join the e-digital tribe and, you know, we won't spam you. We do not disturb you. We have office hours every week and it's just, I think, three or four days a week. And after that, we're quiet. All right. I promise you. So come in and join and meet with like-minded people network and get a chance to share your ideas and get new ideas on how you can have a more digitally fulfilling life, you know, as well as meet new people. So that'll always be there for you. And you can reach us again on all social media platforms. Just look for eDigital Africa. And my name is Faith History. You can follow me at Faith History. Thank you so much for listening and we'll catch you next week. Toodles. Everything Digital. Everything Digital is proudly brought to you by MTN. This is a Faith History production.